All three children abandoned by the same mother as infants are now reunited after 30 years. KKL 9's Christy Fajardo has the amazing story of how they found each other. It was Santa Claus. Janet Barnicote's photo album exactly. has grown since her last Mother's Day. It's been a really crazy uh, roller coaster. But the pictures captured moments even she couldn't fathom. <laughs> It was a year and a half ago that we showed you this unlikely reunion between two abandoned babies. <laughs> so amazing. Now grown and reunited through an ancestry website and their DNA. Her brother Dean Hundorf told us at the time. I was more just, you know, I was interested in my, you know, ethnic makeup and this was something I never would have dreamed of. Nor did he dream he would soon find another DNA match. A sister, Julie, who, like them, had also been abandoned at birth in Lawndale. There was a connection. Um, it, it was like we had never been apart from each other. But the three still had questions. Who was the mother who had left Julie at a mini market, Dean on a doorstep, and Janet in a paper bag in an alley? Old clippings show the woman who found her, Joanne Hauser, visiting her in the hospital in 1981. Hi. Barnicote even met her a few years ago, but this video would soon take on new meaning because Barnicote says she would later learn Hauser was their mother. We asked her, you know, did you love us? And she said, oh God, I thought about you every day, I loved you every day. We couldn't reach Hauser for comment. But Barnicote says she learned she'd never been left in an alley and soon found her biological father. I want to say it was like a sigh of relief. You know, I had gone 15, 20 years with that story in my head constantly of, you know, I was tossed away, I was thrown by a dumpster. Barnicote says she's forgiven Hauser, who was already a single mother and struggling. She says she doesn't think others should judge her either. She did us a favor, and then I'm not saying anything bad on, on her part, but I mean, all three of us had amazing families. In Hesperia, Christy Fajardo, KCAL 9 News. Wow.